Hello friends and welcome. Thank you for joining me today for some uh, RimWorld Fort Ranchos. My name is Sean and when we left off it was day number, what happened? I'm on the wrong line. Where do I want to be? Right there. Day number 243. We are starting our fifth year here in this colony. Yeah, it says 5504, but that's because we've completed four full years. It's really exciting stuff. Um, and... What was going on? Ah, we had been raided by these mechs, and so I think I set them all to be shut down. And who is our good person to take apart mechs? I believe that is, well, it could be Hammonds, could be Yang, Lucky Strike. Hammonds, Yang, or Lucky Strike. Oh, I only have certain ones that I'm set to do construction, though. Lucky Strike? All right, Lucky Strike's going to be our new... Uh, our new uh, doctor constructor here. So uh, we have this guy. Health modification. Remove part. Lucky strike, right? Yeah, lucky strike. Prioritize that, please. And I know there's another one around here. I also went through and set up to fill all the holes in the walls that uh, that the uh, raid that the uh, mech set up, you know, while they were raiding and stuff. Is that the only the only one we downed, huh? That's too bad. But you know, could have been worse. Maybe I already took one of them apart. I don't think so. Oh. Need to get that glitter world medicine inside. Ah, looks like I know nope, those are bionic legs. Well, those could use being taken inside too, but actually, I could sh probably should just go ahead and assign the surgery for him. Seems like everybody has a bionic leg nowadays. Most everybody, anyways. Um, so Lagomorpha, you're a slowpoke, and you're incapable of dumb labor. Well, you're probably one of the last people I want to have. Uh, uh, what's wrong with Cameron? Totally joy deprived. What's going on, Cameron? Just not enough, uh, not enough, uh, joy items around? It's not like we have a ton of them, but I didn't think we had so few that you would be totally joy deprived. That's pretty serious. Well, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I can um, I guess try to find a spot where I could throw some more down. I suppose I could throw a joy thing in our workshop, but I'd kind of rather leave it for for workshop stuff. How nice is it in here? Somewhat impressive. Well, I could easily, I could easily bump that up. I would say, um, if I move, uh, move some of this stuff around, I could put a pool table in there. It's pretty crowded, though. And if I move this battery outside, I could definitely get a uh, 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 get a boost in the quality of of the room. Not necessarily get a pool table in there, but at least it would boost the quality of the room. Probably pretty ugly with uh, some of these workshops, yeah. Although I think that's a piece of slag that's ugly, not necessarily the, um, because that battery is pretty ugly, minus 16. And I'm guessing it's the piece of slag that's at minus 16, not the workbench, because it seems like all the other workbenches are at like twos, or neutral, and it's probably the floor that's at two. Um, so let's uh, let's try to rearrange things around here a little bit. I'm gonna put you down over in here. Oh, look at that! We'll uh, get the benefit of having that uh, having that workbench there. There we are. And set bill. I want to rearrange the. Uh, 
stockpile zone for our raw smoke leaf. Copy settings, delete. Paste settings, there we go. Get that over there. So that means I can go ahead and just deconstruct that. Probably ought to get rid of these stools. Um, and then I will reinstall some of these other chairs. I'm in the middle of redoing that stuff too, aren't I? I probably shouldn't try not to set up too many uh, too many things at once for our uh, projects here. Do I have this facing out? Okay, good. It looked like it was facing out when it's on. Couple of excellent stools there. Although I suppose a uh, any sort of plasteel um, chair is going to be better than an excellent steel chair. All right, so those are all well locked up. I want to get uh, want to get these set up, but I don't have just I just need more people doing construction. But I don't really want to set anybody else on construction because I want to get the uh, I want to get the constructors like leveled up. So how about I just let people do their jobs, stop giving them more stuff to do. Very uh, jazzy theme music. I really like this theme music. It's a, an all upbeat, happy. I knew I had another one of these guys. Lagomorpha that was doing that? No, it was Lucky Strike. Right. Come on, Lucky Strike, my friend. Oh, you're visiting your grave. Yeah, worry about that later. Why well, that's forbidden? Probably just because it's outside the home zone or something. Here comes Tia. Build that solar panel. Yeah, I've just got too many uh, building projects set up for everybody, so it's just taking a while to get to them all. Uh, speaking of too many projects set up, mm, he's praying. I don't really want to interrupt his joy activity. Bjorn is going for a walk. Probably shouldn't interrupt that joy activity either, but I'll let Hammonds get the relaxing time. Uh, oh, too soon, huh? All right, how about the uh, other, other ones? Also too soon. Wait less than an hour. Well, I shouldn't have interrupted poor uh, Bjorn's uh, joy activity. Probably already going to be time for him to, uh, to make that call by the time he gets back over here. Has it been 0 0.6 hours? Looks like it has. Alright, exotic goods trader. Thank you. Disconnect. We probably have that other one coming and uh, they'll be here soon I'm sure. Need to get some of that stuff hauled back in before they show up. Stop giving them instructions Sean. Let the wind do its job. I say that and I go give them more instructions. But those are important, important instructions to get these uh, stools installed down here. We do need them to eat and everything. Extreme break risk, huh? Cameron, you just... Mm. So frustrating. Yeah, no shit. You're at an extreme break risk because you just went on a giant break for no particular reason that I could see. <sighs> just need to calm down. Now, building this out of plasteel will be awesome. Hey, you know what? We actually have enough plasteel. Let's do it. Uh, I'm going to build it right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reinstall you there. Um, I'm going to reinstall that bench or chair there. I will make a copy there. How are we doing on plasteel? We actually probably should have quite a bit more since we um, just picked up the... Uh, picked up all those mechanoids and we'll be tearing them apart real soon. 
Uh, so, Joy, Plasteel Billiards Table. There you go, right there. Beautiful. Is it already screenshot time? I guess it is. That's kind of a rhetorical question. This guy doesn't really need his uh, table because he's stuck in bed. Um, let's let's get that screenshot then. We'll wait until. I guess wait until these guys are done constructing. I kind of wanted to get a picture of their beautiful billiards table. How'd that come out? Superior. Very nice. So this room, actually this billiards table, should push this room into an interesting level. Let's, uh, let's take a look out of the way. Whatever that thing is, Steam information. Very impressive, good. Okay, so they're gonna get a joy bonus if they use that room, and of course they'll get a bonus. I think they get a bonus for working in that room. They'll get a bonus for being in that room anyways. Uh, all right, I don't really need to worry about this animal, I don't think. Got all of our walls up. Need to order this area to be mined out. I feel like we're doing... Hey, what happened to my battery? Did I just end up uninstalling it or something? I don't even... I don't know where that would have would have ended up. Like is overflow storage. I don't have a furniture storage area set up, do I? Oh, there it is. Weird. Stall right there, please. Uh, where is our standard batteries? Let's unforbid that guy. Um, there's one of them right there. Yeah, it's full. We got plenty of battery power and nothing to worry about. Um, I feel like somewhere there was a, like a spaceship park crashed down. You know what? I think that was in the stream I played. Hey, if you came and checked out the stream on Saturday, thank you very much. That was really fun. I didn't do very well. I haven't had, um, such a disastrous, uh, uh, run of events for quite a while since Fort, uh, not Fort Ranchos, since Sago Lago, or no, not Sago Lago either. Knife's Edge. Knife's Edge was a, a pretty much a disaster. And um, Twin Oases, uh, things went pretty poorly there too. So uh, it was fun to, to lose badly at the game, I guess, if you consider that fun. Um, and uh, yeah, I had a good time overall. And I hope you will uh, come back next Saturday where I'm going to start a new colony. And I'm pretty much going to have a new colony every week. It's kind of my plan. Oh, I should not be putting the best tables in these prison rooms. It's all well and good for these prisoners, but... Uh, that one I'm actually going to uh, take apart. Somebody come on over and disassemble this table, would you? I guess all my constructors must be asleep. Hey, let's uh, let's um, do the uh, trading thing. I feel like our good trader is already asleep. That's Hammonds. He's sleeping. Cameron, you should not be at level one there. Greenhagen, what are you doing? What kind of what kind of scam are you trying to pull? Um, Cameron or Bjorn? Bjorn, are you awake? Bjorn is awake. Good. Come on up here. Holy shit! What's going on there? <laughs> Well, probably uh, not going to uh, endear these guys to my colony. Well, I'm not concerned about the fire. Poplar tree has died from rotting due to being left unharvested. Well, that's unfortunate. Especially since it's a tree. Like, those should not be rotting that quickly. That's pretty annoying, to be honest. Um... All right, well, I don't want to buy a fox that just caught on fire, especially. Uh, nor do I want to sell any of my dromedaries. Uh, I'm not concerned about these food, any food trading. i got plenty of components. You know, I'm doing all right on Glitter World Medicine, to be honest. Go ahead and sell some joints. Let's try that again. Sell some joints. 
doing alright on Panoxia. I'll, I'll, I'll cap it off at 100. Um, don't need those things, don't need those things. Oh, you have no, no, uh, uh, bionics to sell me. What kind of trader are you? Um, do I have any dead man's goods? No, not really. So I just have some junky stuff to sell. We're already pretty close to the cap. So is there something that's about $30? No? Alright. Uh, you know, I could buy some more gold, I guess. It's an awful lot of gold. I don't really need that much. I'll buy 50, I suppose. Just so I can sell some of these things. Mm. I kind of want to sell that power armor helmet. It's worth an awful lot. It's really expensive. Probably more valuable than uh, than uh, uh, using it. So I'm going to sell it. Alright, so now I've got uh, 400. I don't need that psychic foil helmet, that's for sure. Um, I want to keep those personal shields. And sell this somewhat rundown duster, I guess. And I just want to sell one other thing. Like, I don't have any t-shirts or other kind of clothes that I wouldn't normally wear. Doesn't look like it. it. Looks like all the clothes that we have are stuff that I've made. I'll sell one pair of cotton pants. Can I sell two? 2480. That's too much. All right, we'll do that. That's good enough. Uh, why don't you haul that uh, Pinoxy? Rest of the stuff I'm not so worried about. I don't think it's going to catch on fire or anything. Thank you, Chance. Let's uh, install this table right there. Gonna play a little, uh, uh, what is that called? Like when you rotate things. I definitely want to uh, set that to drop on floor. There we go. Musical chairs. We're gonna play a little musical chairs with our tables here. And get the okay ones into the. Uh, into the prisons and get the nice ones into the uh, uh, into the living quarters. Much better. Now everybody can be happy. Doing good on food. No worries there. Got uh, plenty of steel. Let's go ahead and build up some more um, of these guys. go. I'm going to make sure that this one gets reconnected to the uh, proper power connection. Of course, they'll probably build it last or something. I should make sure that these um, solar panels are in the home area because it doesn't seem like they're getting repaired. This definitely should be in the home area as long, along with the wall around it. Like that. There we go. Keep going. And you know, sometimes I actually do learn things from watching um, uh, uh, watching other people, even people who uh, are not as experienced as I am in this game. I was watching somebody play on, they're playing on uh, some difficulty, um, but somebody had told them that they should build chairs in the uh, area where they're doing their fighting. And uh, I was like, you know what, that's a really good idea. Why not let the people who are fighting get a little bit of comfort? So I'm going to try that too. I don't really have a lot of cotton or anything, so I'm not going to build uh, armchairs. But I do have enough materials to where I can build just some wooden chairs. And uh, sure, they're probably going to get beat up um, while they are uh, uh, beat up with all the fighting. But why not have some uh, chairs set up out here? I suppose it's possible that these are pointless, so don't uh, don't take that necessarily as like a RimWorld pro tip or anything. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna try it. We'll see. People like sitting in chairs. I know that much. All right, so these don't necessarily need to be food. So I'm gonna make them. Um, actually, let's make some from cotton. 
And we'll make some of them smoke leaf as well. Alright, we are producing uh, hay again, so I'm going to go ahead and clear this stockpile out so we don't feed all of our rice to the uh, animals. I think I need to assign somebody else to uh, gardening. We're just not keeping up with that. We'll just bump Jack back up. Could put Mew Horde onto it as well. Mew Horde's got a lot on its plate. Lucky Strike, I'm going to increase his researching uh, frequency. Anybody else? Yang? I could have Yang do some more growing. What does he mostly do? He mostly does like clothing and stuff. Gonna bump that up too. Alright, that should be fine. Slow down our specialization a little bit, but uh, alright, we've already traded with those guys, so I'm gonna close all those things so I don't keep getting confused. I don't know why that's going on. There we go. But yeah, having those trees not get chopped down. It's like the worst period. End of sentence. It didn't sound like the end of the sentence, but it was intent uh, totally intended to be that from the very start. All along. There's no, no change in my plans. I didn't make a mistake by any means. Alright, I need to reconnect that down to the regular wire like I had talked about earlier. Where are we at? 12th of spring. Oh, we got plenty of time before winter comes. So we should be able to get at least two crops of hay grass out of it. That'll be good. And what am I switching this over to? I think I probably ought to switch that over to hay as well. Because we are using a lot of hay. It was not, uh, not good to have those animals starve. We could use more Devil Strand for sure. Although, you know, what am I going to do? I don't really have anywhere that I could grow it. I guess I could try setting a... Uh, setting a farm somewhere out in the boonies. I mean, I could, I'd could. i have to go way over here. And that's all sandstone anyways. That's not even... Uh, I couldn't grow in that even if I wanted to. Well, shit. Up here? That's, yeah. So I could I could set a Devil Strand farm up there. The problem is, is that that might become a, a target for raiders. These guys have also cassowaries. Uh, a couple more breaks, breaks down. Um, I don't mind that. Hammonds, you're a good trader, right? Do I remember correctly? Oh boy, it's almost like I've played this for 70-something episodes. Hey, I don't know if you guys um, have any thoughts on the new thumbnail for this. Do, does it matter? I tried to make it a little more visible and eye-catching and uh, maybe, uh, you know, I, I put in the no turret, no trap thing, maybe to attract new viewers. And the Fort Ranchos, I pulled that out because although that is the name of the series, that's like the... I guess you guys probably don't need to know the name of the series, right? Like, you're just like subscribed or subscribed to the playlist or something like that. Seems like that's how people would be watching this more than anything else. Cooking Narrow Trainer. Hmm. I thought I had a Persona Core to sell, but I guess I don't. Um, I'm going to keep that cooking neuro trainer in mind, uh, but they got lots and lots of bionics. And I still never installed the bionics that I got from the last one either, so uh, I don't think I'm going to get that cooking neuro trainer because I don't think I'm going to be able to afford it. But oh, lots of good bionics here. Um, do I want to sell any of these clothes? I 
don't need that parka, but I don't have a parka, so I definitely can't sell it. Nope. And I don't want to sell any of those necessarily. Um, probably shouldn't have bought all that gold from the last trader because it's uh, uh, we don't have enough money at this point. Um, all right, let's look through this again. I might just might not be able to buy the uh, all the bionics I want, which would be a real bummer. Put that skyther blade in there. Yep, good. Oh, well, that's too bad. Um, I guess I will uh, only take one eye. We'll see if we can figure out a way to make uh, make up that extra thousand that we're short. Uh, I could make a couple of plasteel equipment racks. Um, do I have any silver that's like not collected yet or anything? No, it looks like I've collected it all. What's going on over here? Somebody dead from long, long ago. Hmm. Uh, it looks like the answer is going to be no to those things. But what I could say yes to is installing all these bionics that I have. I was going to start doing that earlier, and then I never got around to it. Um, so, like, Lagomorpha. Do we have anybody... Let's see if we have anybody that needs bionics first. We need some bionic noses, I guess. So Lagomorphus, the only one who doesn't have any bionics. What do you do? Animals, construction and growing and crafting. Yeah, I guess the, the leg would make up for you being a slow poke. So let's do that. Put you on fancy medicine. Add bill, bionic leg. I believe we have two bionic legs and a bionic arm. So who deserves a bionic leg that doesn't have one yet? You're a prostophobe. Yang, I guess. Bionic leg. And I, now I have two bionic arms. Bjorn, are you a prostophobe or anything? Nope. Um, that bionic arm would actually come in pretty handy for you. So, I have Bill, bionic arm. Almost forgot to do that. And now I have two bionic eyes. Unfortunately, my best ranged people already uh, have, or they're prostophobes, so that's kind of a shame. Jack, yeah, you're trigger happy. I don't really want to give it to you. Muhort, Muhort, you're not a prostophobe. You're just a good shooter. You do already have one bionic eye, though. Draconic Rose. Don't really need bionic eye for cleaning. Hammonds, you've got one. Chowns, Prostphobe. All right, wow, you've already got a bionic eye, too. Everybody's gotten... We're really bionicing up here. Uh, so I guess... Uh, Tia, you're going to get one. Bionic eye. And... Um, Greenhagen. All right, now let's make sure everybody who's scheduled for an operation can use the fancy medicine. Looks like the answer is yes. Good. All right. Only good doctors turned on? Shush now. Answer to that is also yes. Um, right. Well, shh. I don't want to uh, want to have any mistakes crop up with our uh, bionic installations, like having uh, stoned doctors come in or anything like that. So, oh shit, I also need to do that. So now I need to go through and make sure that nobody is installing bionics. Like Lucky Strike here. Alright, you're not stoned, so that's good. Now you can install a bionic leg. All right, everybody else is good.
Greenhagen, you're going to go rest. Heat wave, that's okay. We can uh, deal with the heat wave, no problem. Tia, you're resting. Cameron, you're making a joint. You're still not stoned, so that's fine. Chowns. You're just hauling. Alright, doesn't matter whether you're stoned or not. Hammonds. Not stoned, that's good. I felt like we had one more person doing a... Uh, <clears throat> one more person getting surgery too, but maybe not. Unless they're getting surgery over in their... Over in their bed or something. We have Bjorn, Tia, Lagomorpha, Greenhagen. Yep, that's four. Hmm. Mewhort, maybe? No? I just don't want any doctors killing anybody. Oh, Yang. You have an operation scheduled. Great. So let's see if... Uh, See if somebody's going to come and do that. Looks like Hammonds. Hammonds. Not stoned. Good. All right. Well, that's good. Um, so we're going to call that an episode. Uh, thanks, you guys, for watching today. If you enjoyed this video, I'd love to hear from you down in the comments. Just a reminder, I do stream on Twitch on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Saturdays. Saturday is RimWorld Day over there, so check that out. Uh, look at the details down in the description below. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you here again real soon with the next episode. Bye.